15906 for Joe Beaver. Point. They come to the second. The green flag is out. We're underway here at Knoxville. Oh, the checkered flag is out, and heat race number one belongs to Kevin Swindell. He smoked in hot laps, and in qualifying and smoking now. Hopefully not an engine problem. He continues to lead it, but more and more smoke continuing to come out of the 90. Up to the high side goes the 5J. He'll look for the position. It's hurt three and four. He's got it. The 5J and Jamie Ball up in the second. Justin Henderson falls to third. Now going to fall to fourth. Problems on the one. Smoke coming out of the left bank of that machine as Tony Bruce Jr. moves up into the third spot. Right off of turn number four, the checkered flag will fly this time for the Raging Cajun Jason Johnson, a heat race winner at Knoxville. How about a hand there for the 17W of Colwood? Through turn number four, the checkered flag is out. The 18R of Ryan Roberts will win in heat race number five. Ladies and gentlemen, the cars and stars on night number one of the Arnold Motor Supply ASCS Knoxville Nationals in their parade lap to you. Escobedo lead early on, takes the inside lane. Lee Gross jumps to second place down the back straight away. Lee Gross to the high side, Johnson down to the bottom. He's up to second now. Here comes Jason Johnson at 41. Down the back straightway, so is Jason Johnson though, as they nearly go three wide with the race leader. Look at this. Anyway, Look Nick at Johnson wants it. He'll have to come and get it. He works to the inside of your race leader into turn three. And a turn number four, the 41 has to slide high. It's going to be the 56 of Davey Heskin in victory lane. Davey Heskin will grab the win. Jason Johnson crossing in second. Tony Bruce Jr. will cross in third. One more time, give it up for him, ladies and gentlemen. Davey Heskin. Just really kind of played into our hands and the car just turned, the car kept getting better over the course of the night. We really didn't touch a whole lot, little half turn here, suck the right rear in a little bit. But it just came to us so much when the track started to free up. I just felt like we got better and better and better. Couldn't be happier, you know? I guess we could have been happier if we won, but you know, we quick time, charged through the heat. We battled up through there pretty good, and I'm, I'm pretty happy with our crew, man. They made some great decisions, and you know, Good, good horsepower under the hood and just made it easy tonight, kind of. Just everything fell into place. It's pretty cool. Yeah, you know, we wanted to win. I ain't gonna lie. Um, and we had the opportunity to win. Just come up a little bit short. You know, definitely a great night points-wise. I mean, it could have went a lot worse, but, um, you know, you always want that um, front row starting spot come Saturday night. You know, I get the easy part. I get to, I get to sit in that car and have fun. And Love you, all of All of these guys that put in all the hard work at the shop, I just can't thank the guys enough.